Hello Coolers and welcome back to Viva Barca, the home of everything Barca, where we are going to be discussing the latest on FC Barcelona as usual. We start with Sergio Busquets. It has been reported that Premier League champions Manchester City are looking to sign the Barcelona veteran in the summer on a two-year deal. We are going to be discussing much on that report as we move ahead. Then secondly, we are going to be talking about Oscar Mingueza as it has been reported that three La Liga teams are currently interested in signing the 22-year-old. We are going to be elaborating much on the development as we move ahead. So guys, as we get ready to discuss those stories in much detail, please make sure to subscribe to the channel. If you haven't subscribed, give this video a like and make sure to watch this video right up to the very end. Barcelona have had a number of years to sort out their issues in the defensive midfield. However, they struggle to find a proper replacement for Sergio Busquets. The Spanish international has been irreplaceable for more than a decade for Barcelona. According to a report read by Fitcher Jess, Busquets could be on his way out with Pep Guardiola looking to recruit him in the summer for Man City. The Spanish manager feels as though he could be useful to his side with a midfielder's contract ending in just 18 months' time. Busquets has been a Barcelona first team player from 2008-9. His skill role as the team's holding midfielder has far surpassed that of many of his counterparts. In his many years as, as a Barca player, Busquets has rarely ever been a threat on goal, but his passing ability and vision have kept him at the highest level. As for City, Fernandinho's contract is ending soon and the citizens have no interest in extending the deal. At 36, his time is up and he has been replaced by Rodri. Guardiola thinks that Busquets can perform for the citizens and will table a two-year deal for him. His understanding of positional play is the main factor attracting the sextuple winning manager to him. Busquets after this would benefit from a solid plan by the City Football Group, the report states. After his two years in England clocked down, he would make the move to New York City FC in the MLS where he would play for a further five years. While Barcelona could certainly do with the cash that would come from selling their captain, they are without a proper replacement for him. Frankie de Jong and Nico Gonzalez have not shown proper pedigree to play in that role. Why buying an alternative seems to be out of the picture financially too. Then on to the next story of discussion. Barcelona have had a number of players that they wish to have exited the club. Mostly, they have been unsuccessful with only Philippe Coutinho's loan deal with Aston Villa succeeding. Another player Barcelona seemingly have no interest in keeping is Oscar Mingueza. The centre-back has, you know, has been put to the exit list by Xavi Hernandez. According to a report relayed by Mono Deportivo, there is interest from three La Liga clubs. Jose Bordalas' Valencia are the headlining team who have, you know, who have him on the Gerrada as a potential loan signing. The issue comes in the fact that the Spanish manager prefers Digne um, Dacoman from his former club Getafe over him. The Barca number 22 has been at the club ever since he was 11. He climbed up the ranks in the academy, making it into the B team where he stagnated for some years. Last season, because of an injury um, epidemic in the squad, Mingesta finally got his chance and has since represented Barca on 58 occasions. Despite being versatile and showing his capacity to play in all four spots in a back four. Xavi Hernandez does not see him as an essential. Barcelona already have enough players in the right back and centre back positions, and Mingueza does not make the quantitative or the qualitative cut. This season, he has been much less defensively rigid than the last. His performances, especially at right back, saw him overtaken by Ronald Araujo and Eric Garcia. That said, Mingueza has a bucket load of offers if he indeed wants to leave to look for minutes. Mallorca and Celta Vigo are also chasing his signature from within the league. Why Hertha Berlin have put their name in the heart from the Bundesliga. Barcelona at this point are looking for additional clauses to add to any loan deal that goes through. They want to seek financial compensation from Valencia in the event Mingueza does not receive an adequate amount of minutes. Of course, um, his main competitor, Jenny, is someone Bordelas knows quite well. He played under the Spaniard all throughout his time in Getafe and is willing to reunite with the Togolese as soon as possible. This season, he has represented Los Azulones on 19 occasions and has been a regular for 
Legata for years now. If Mingesa does indeed leave, then the funds amassed will be vital in the forthcoming summer. Barcelona are planning on replacing Mingesa with the likes of Andreas Christensen from Chelsea, among other top central defenders. So colors, with that we come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Hope you did enjoy the video and also hope you did subscribe. If you haven't, please make sure to do so so you always stay in touch with the latest on FC Barcelona here on Viva Barca. Until next time, bye bye.